matokeo yani ni kibao ambacho sijui nikizungumzie vipi sababu mimi nikizungumzia bila ni karibu ama nikafanya nikazungumzie kawa kizuri zaidi lakini unajua ambaye amefanya hicho kibao yuko ndani ya mjengo sasa hivi namzungumzia the beautiful miss samba inakuwaaje niko unapendeza sana yani i love the look and toka chini mpaka juu yani asante sana mimi mwenyewe wewe mwenyewe mm. ah <laughs> Sijui ni zungumze vipi yani unapendeza sana. Asante. You look so amazing yani. Asante. Madogo, mko pale nyumbani sasa hivi. Sana weza unampa simu ngapi kwa kumi? Yaani mimi nakupa kumi kwa kumi. Kumi kwa kumi. Eh? Asante. Yeah. So, uh, Miss Samba. Mhm. Mm mimi kuna vitu vingi nataka nifahamu. Aye. Lakini kwanza kabisa. Mhm. Kile kitu ambacho una kisearch kuhusu na una Pasi Music. Pasi Music. Na ni nini? Uh, pasi ni kikundi la watu ambao wanakuja pamoja ku support each other kwenye yeah. mziki. Iko na watu watatu Nam. Misamba, uh, Bari na Lennox Nam. So mini moja wa ni moja. The si, three oh, Si kundi Lakini Si kikundi ni... Yani Nam. like a music collective Nam. Yani tunakuja pa moja Kusupport each other Si wote ni wasani Tunafanya Nam. mziki na pia tuna Support each other oh, Nini ni kama muna acti kama lebo Nini kama lebo kitu hey, kama kia Exactly Amba chukina simamia mm. wasani Lakini wasani muna jisimamia wenye Exactly eh. Aha, Asha kupata Namu Eh bari eh bari ni msanii Ushafikia exclusive eh Huko unajua bari moni msanii eh Sasa unajua mimi napenda mtu wa kumbukumbu sana na niliambiwa kwamba watoto kike wao wasahau haraka Ni kweli sio? Mm kweli February tarehe 23 mwaka 2018 Unakumbuka nini? Eh ilikuwa nili release ngoma yangu Naam inaitwa interest Interest Hebu nizungumzie interest Ni interest ya kuingia kwa muziki ama ni interest na dogo fulani Ni interest na dume fulani Naam Ambaye ni ile like kwanza song Not really yani niliandika tu it's not it's not a, uh, a real life situation Nam. ni ngoma ambayo tu nilikaa chini nikafikiria nikaandika si kuandika mimi mwenyewe nilisaidiwa na habari Naam tuliandika mimi na yeye so aliandika some parts alafu pia mimi nikachangia Naam ni ngoma ambayo ilifanya vizuri sana mimi nilikuwa naipenda nikisikiza wakati fulani mm -hmm. na kasema kwamba huyu msanii akiendelea kutia bidii atafika mbali na baada ya miezi miwili ukachia kibao kingine sio eh nikatoa shibeta shibeta um, nilifanya kazi na msanii ambaye anaitwa Steph Kapela Steph Kapela very dope artist juka mnamjua na Steph Kapela I love his music ako na yani ile sound a new sound yenye haiko hapa Kenya at the moment Nam. so niliposikiza mziki yake niliupenda na nikasema ah msanii nataka kufanya kazi naye then i reached out to him akakubali tukaenda studio tuka record Nam. alafu ndio wimbo hapo sasa experience ilikuwa vipi kufanya experience ilikuwa poor he's a very cool person very Nam. humble guy nampenda sana shout out to steph Nam. steph <laughs> yeah steph to you mzee <laughs> yeah unajua nikisikiza mziki wako kabisa mm -hmm. ni mtindo wa rnb rnb hivi wewe ni mtu ambaye unapenda mapenzi mapenzi sana au unataseka kwa mapenzi sana mueleza <laughs> sababu unajua mziki wa rnb wao una taswira fulani <laughs> Zingine ni real life kama hiyo shibeta ilikuwa Nam. real life. Ah ilikutokea. Yeah, yeah ilikutokea ilitokea mimi nilikuwa na boyfriend yangu Nam. akatoka akaenda akaniacha alafu akataka tena kurudi alafu ndo nikamwambia pana uwezi rudi sasa hii sasa hizi mambo yamebadilika you can't come back. Nam. So to say msa sasa hivi uko single. No I'm not single. <laughs> oh, ndo alirudi ukamkubalia. Hapana si huyo na mwingine. <laughs> so, Wewe nilimkata wewe alishaenda mm. ukishaenda umeenda unajua ukishatapika uwezi tena Rudisha. Rudisha. Ukisha achana na mtu na mocha ende. Ani mm. sana juwa madogo wa muantazama shosho wa mjaro wali. Kini sawa, tieska usijali. Tieska usijali, kuna next time pia. Kabe otege ya tu mkaribie. Pia mgimibu mwini atalondoka pia ambiwe shibeta. <laughs> Saa, nilikuwa napita katika Instagram account yako. Alafu nikuona kuna post ambu uli post. Na nyajua watu ingi mibu ambu wana kufatilia wangitaka kuifamu. Mibu nikuona jari kukumanisha nini. Mm. Uli post picha kwa nikisho kwa nika feel the burn. Feel the burn. Nam. Feel the burn. Okay. Um, apart from music, Nam. niko katika fitness pia. Nam. So feel the burn ni a series of yani clips, video clips za fitness ambayo niko nataka sasa nitakuwa nikizitoa. Nam. So yani feel the burn inamaanisha unajua mtu aki work out kuna, kuna ile uchungu, oh, oh, kuna ile burn. Yeah, yeah. Sasa feel the burn. Hapo ndo natokea feel the burn. Hebu uh, mm. tuzungumzie kidogo fitness. Mm. Ah, ndio kitu ambacho unakifanya kando na mziki ama ni kitu ambacho unataka e, kukifanya full time. Kitu ambacho nakifanya kando na mziki. Ndio ulianza na mziki kwanza ama fitness kwanza? Nilianza na mziki. I think nilianza zote around the same time. Around the same time. Mm. So inakuwaje changamoto zipi ambazo unazipita ama inakuwaje kufanya fitness 
at the same time unafanya muziki unajua zote ni mbili ni passion yangu Nam. fitness unajua ni lifestyle una, watu wanafaa kuwa healthy napenda ku encourage watu you know Nam. young girls and older women go to the gym eat healthy yani just be healthy basically so napenda fitness na pia napenda music so uh, at the moment sisi sema niko na challenge sana kwa fitness challenge kubwa sana ni kwa mziki kwa <laughs> fitness iko sawa so sema ukisema kwamba uko sawa katika fitness inamaanisha kwamba maybe una sehemu yako ambayo watu wanakuja kufanya ile uh, tuko into niko na team yangu ambayo wanafanya kazi nayo uh, tuko into corporate fitness Nam. basically what we do um, tuko na group of trainers so unajua corporate companies Nam. kuna kwanga na watu wa vivu hawataki kwenda kwenye gym so Nam. what we do we make the work easier for you so tunatuma wale trainers pale wanawa train Ah. Unaelewa? Naam. Eh. So mtu yote akitaka tu kama ana vivu fulani hata kwa nyumba mlezo mkenda kwa nyumba. Hata hata kwa unataka kukuja ah. kutraini kwa nyumba tunakutumia trainer na kutraini kwa kwa nyumba. Ah, ukitaka kupata unapata wapi hizo sehemu za ku wakitaka kuitisha maybe hiyo. Wakitaka mimi Samba kwa page yangu tu alafu pia kuna page ya Fit to Beats. Naam. So unaweza ku DM Fit to Beats, unaweza pia mimi ku DM kwa mi, at Miss Samba. Naam, kabisa. Mm. Tumesikia leo watu wamefahamu kidogo. Unajua tulikuwa najiuliza hata mimi nilikuwa napita na shaka ana fitness kwa sana kwa nini kinaendelea lakini imefahamu sasa. Ah uh, tukiangalia sasa umefanya kibao kipi ya uh, one for you. Eh hey, one for you. Inazungumzia nini one for you? One for you ni love song. Inazungumzia mapenzi. Naam. Mm. Ni nikwambia nilikuwa <laughs> mapenzi sana yani. Ni mtakao tunajua tu. So hiyo one for you ni mbona umefanya na Barack Jacuzzi. Mm. Alafu Barack Jacuzzi pia ameona anafanya kazi nzuri pale. Lakini kuna kitu ambacho mimi nilikosa majibu sasa. Mm. Mbona uliamua kumtumia Barimo kama video vixen pale ndani? Niliamua kumtumia Barimo kama video. Yeah. Barimo alikuwa anataka kutokea kwenye video. Sasa mimi siwezi kumwambia huyo hapana hawezi kuja kwa video. Alisema mimi nataka kutoka kutokea kwenye video. Alafu ndio nikamwambia haya basi utakuwa bartender, utakuwa yeah. waiter. Ah <laughs> <laughs> uh, alikuwa amesema bartender ndio. Si bartender, yeah. sorry waiter. <laughs> waiter. So, Same thing. <laughs> Naam, tuangalia video zako wewe kwa kuchagua ma video vixen ukosei. Ni vitu vipi ambavyo unagaliaga kwanza before uchague mtandao wa video vixen katika ngoma yako? <sighs> Wasiangalia ngi sana yani. Naam. As long as uko na ile hauko camera shy, you can be in front of the camera na unaweza kufanya vitu mbele ya camera. We are good to go. Kama mtu wa kidume kifua kikuepo, miraba. Hata <laughs> siangalia ngi hizo. <laughs> Hata watu kama sisi tunaweza tukabaki hey. kati. <laughs> si lazima kuwa na six pack na hizo vitu vingine. Si lazima kabisa. <laughs> si lazima. So tukiangalia unajua kabla sasa tuzungumzie kibao kwa sana kabisa hii one for you. Nimeangalia mm -hmm. nimechunguza kwa hizi ngoma zako ambazo umezifanya so far umefanya collab na rappers. Wewe unaamua kufanya na rappers? Napenda rappers. I love rap music na napenda ku Unajua rappers pia wako na ile crowd yao. So nataka ku penetrate kwa ile crowd ya rappers. Uh, Vengine nilikuwa naandika one for you. Vengine nilimaliza kuandika I felt like it needed some rap unajua ku break the monotony ya kuimba so then um nilimaliza kuiandika alafu nikaambia Lennox nikatumia Lennox nikamwambia waweza kusikiza hii nyimbo i feel like it needs a rapper ndio sasa Lennox ndo ka suggest Barack and then we reached out to him akakubali kuja kufanya collab and then Barack kwa ile yani wasanii wakukatai anakukubali tena na Barack sana nani wasanii wao ukatao na kukubali nashukuru Mungu sana kabisa na unafanya kazi nzuri sana lakini nikiangalia kwa kwa kazi zako nyingi ambazo umezifanya Uh, na unao umefanya kazi na Atwal Music. Yeah, nimefanya na Atwal. Napenda sound yake, alafu unajua pia Atwal ako very professional. Yaani yule ni producer mmoja ambaye is very professional na mimi napenda professional people. Atwal ni mtu ambaye ukimwambia nataka hii, atakufanyia kenye unataka. Si kama nime nime meet na producers wengi bandia. Nam. Mtu namtumia pesa anamwambia kutengeneze beat, kisha anaenda ku download beat kwa internet anakutumia. Hebu mtaje, mimi hapo mashariki kuna. Siwezi mtaja, siwezi mtaja najijua. Ah, unamwambia kutengeneze beat, unamtumia pesa, alafu anaenda na download beat, anakutumia beat ime downloadiwa. Sasa unabaki ukishanga, ai, ningetaka ku download beat, mimi mwenyewe ningeenda ku download. Singekutumia pesa ndio download ndio nitumie. So kuna a lot of very unprofessional producers that's why napenda kuwa na Twal. But I'm looking to work with different producers because unajua pia producers wanakwanga na different sound, wanakwanga na touch different. Nam. Yeah. So tuseme maybe nyimbo zingine ambazo zitatoka sasa zitakuwa na ma producer tofauti tofauti. Eh producer tofauti tofauti. So huu mwaka kuna kibao kingine kitatokea ama ni ndogo. Ah new to huu ndo mwisho. Eh hiyo ndo nafunga naye. Kabisa. Na tukiangalia hicho kibao kuna vitu viwili vitatu nataka nifahamu. Ulivaa nguo ngapi katika hiyo video? Hiyo video? Naam. Ah chani hesabu <laughs> moja mbili tatu nne nne tano tano <laughs> uko shuwa kabisa ina matano ina matano 
kabisa ni ilikuwa imeendoka ime kwenye script uvai ngo 4 5 ama ni wewe mwenyewe ndio uliamua ni mimi mwenyewe ndio niliamua mm. so nani alikuwa ameandika script mimi wewe ndio uliandika script mpaka mm. kutafuta location ama allocation nilisaidiwa nilisaidiwa kutafuta location alafu sasa Nam. kwenye script mimi niliandika ukiangalia haina script sana Nam. ni kitu very simple alafu sasa unajua ikishashutiwa ile wakati ya ku edit ni mimi nasema hii itumiwe hapa hii itumiwe hapa hii itumiwe hapa so niko very hands on on oh, project zangu wani unahakisha kwamba una usika katika ile yeah, na usika katika ile editing chaka process chaka tumzima mbona exactly. unafanyika mm. mm. ni kitu cha si cha kawaida sana wasanii wao vivu kisha shoot video kwa <laughs> director hapa na mimi niko very hands on nataka kujua nini kinaendelea mm. kazi nzuri sana na kabla u perform hicho kibao kizindue kwa mara ya kwanza hapa ndani ya wema shariki mimi mm. wageni wangu siwaachi bure Samahani. Wageni wangu wasiwachi bure. Wageni? Ah, okay. Na uh -huh. kuna maswali nazita kali za wana. Aha. Uh -huh. uh, ni maswali tu ya kizushi kizushi hivi. Okay. Uh, maybe wewe uko tayari kufunga harusi, sio? Umependa mtu mume mnataka kufunga pingu za maisha nini vitu kama vile. Alafu one day before the wedding mm -hmm. unafahamu kwamba huyu mtu ambaye unataka kufunga naye harusi hashai kuhusika kimapenzi na ndugu yako na dada yako. Na ndugu yangu na dada yangu. Na okay, wakati um Uta, utafunga harusi naye ama utaacha it depends kama alikuwa amenia aku ameniambia before Nam. na ni kitu pia dadangu alikuwa anajua na ah sidhani nitafunga harusi naye tatana naye utakatiza mm. acha ikae <laughs> <laughs> kwa sababu hakuna ile trust sasa already Nam. Nam. and you cannot go into a relationship that has no trust trust lazima ikuwe ni kitu muhimu sana katika relationship so Nam. kama hakuna ile trust ndio basi Uta, una, wakati unapita barabarani hivyo lafoto umeketi kitani sio mm. unajisikiaje auto kicheka lakini wako cheki wewe Mi wa, most of the time wana earphones kwa masikio hata sisikii huwa natembea na natembea na earphones na earphones so most of the time hata sisikii watu wanasema nini so hujisikia labda mtu akikucheka lakini ikatokea ukasikia naam no i just proceed with my business oh, naendelea kutembea mm. naam katika bio uh, katika instagram yako yako mm. umeandika nini katika bio yako Nimeandika uh, pale juu artist, Nam. fitness enthusiast. Mm. Uh, nimeandika one for you featuring yeah. Barack Jacuzzi is out yeah. now yeah. on YouTube. Yeah. Uh, nini ngine nimeandika? I think ni hizo tu. Eh, akale ana kumbukumbu ile. Ni ni bora usingizie mimba na Barack Jacuzzi ya Motel Brown. Ebiru dilo swali tena sitakupata vizuri. Mimba na Barack Jacuzzi ya Motel Brown. Kusingiziwa mimba na manisha nini? Is it better for a person to claim that you're pregnant for Otile Brown or Barack Jacuzzi? Barack Jacuzzi. Barack Jacuzzi. Mbona yeye? Ndio nimekwambia mimi napenda rappers. Napenda rappers. Otile Brown ni mwimbaji, yes he rapper. Mimi napenda rappers. Napenda rappers. Sawa. Kabisa, ushaenda hospitali kupima malaria alafu ukaambiwa na daktari pia upime ukimu. Ah ah. Jai jai tokea. Ah ah bado. Hizo maswali zako. Ni same gani ukiomekaa alafu nikija nikombe picha? utakubali uh, depends kisiezi fikiria saa hizi mm. sembo gani mimi huanga ready always nikitoka kwa nyumba na kuanga ready for anything so hata sehemu yote ambayo umekaa tunaweza kupiga picha naweza kupiga picha kama kuna vileo pale kuna vileo vileo ni nini yeah. <laughs> <laughs> mtazamaji amekuwa hapa ni miss sana msanii mbaya tumefahamu mengi sana kumhusu na tumefahamu kwamba anapenda marapas kama ni mshikaji ambaye ni msanii ambaye unataka ku rap ni unataka kuja collab na mcheck lakini watu watakupata katika mitandao ya kijamii misamba facebook misamba instagram misamba yani misamba on all social media platforms naam mm. wana kufollow tu pale mtazamaji ulivyosikia na ngoma wanapata wapi kwa youtube, kwa YouTube. so far ni kuna videos tatu naam uh, interest Nam. she better na one for you ambayo nimetoa tu juzi so ni kuna videos tatu so far mm hakisha una una, una msupport kwa sana msanii ambaye anapiga mziki mzuri mziki mtindo wa R&B ambao kama wewe unaisi ah nataka mala vidavi hapo pale anakupa unaisi kabisa na mdikitia mpenzi wako kwa sasa acha sijui tupe test kwa unaja tupe ka sauti kidogo hivi ambapo alafu watu wajue kabisa ni yeye si zile auto tune sio acha uh, tupe a cappella acha tupe a cappella test kiki pale niko na homa so msijudge msije mkani judge niko na homa kali sana fantaimba chorus Baby ni onyeshi baby baby ni onyeshi baby baby I'm the one for you and baby you're the one for me baby ni onyeshi baby baby ni onyeshi baby baby I'm the one for you and baby you're the one for me